We bought our first slip house part six. Two million of you guys watching, wondering why this wall is sagging and bowing. Well, without further ado, we figured out the problem and it's in the basement. We removed the ceiling and found they cut away from their double support beam to run ductwork. No, you can't do that. So off to Lowe's I go. I needed to get treated lumber because this is going to be in a basement. And we found some of the things we needed in a crawl space. So that saved us some money. And car jacks. We used car jacks to jack up the weight of the house a little bit at a time. And once we had everything perfectly leveled, then we'll build a wall in between right there to support the weight of the house. So now we just had to cut things down to size, screw together a double header that we also found in the crawl space. We needed to get that in place and use studs to temporarily hold it. Once we had it perfectly placed, we beat in a double post to hold the weight of the house on the right side. Made sure it was level and then repeat it on the right side. We had to crank it up a little. Watch, you can see it. It was crazy. The whole weight of the house, everything was level. Now on this beam, we needed to build a wall underneath. And if you thought this was a hack job, wait till you see how they did the electric. But we ran out of time.